Hey guys, Jonas here from Edge Alert Us. So it's day seven of the Accelerator, and today I'm gonna to summarize the whole course that we've been through. So this will be useful if you've watched the uh, all the videos so far, just as a recap, but it'll also be useful for those who are considering watching all the other videos uh, individually, because it's basically gonna run through uh, all the key points from each day. So my background is in quant finance. I've been a professional derivatives trader for a bunch of years. I worked at 365 uh, for a number of years and I've also been betting for a long time successfully. So firstly, the membership options here, you can see but essentially we do three things. We One, we tip uh, sport and racing promotions. You can see them up here, racing and sport. Uh, secondly, we tip bonus bets. Uh, and that's this membership category here. And then thirdly, we have a bunch of educational material and tools, uh, which you can see here. So the goal of the accelerator, really, for, for most people, I think, is is to get one is to get their head around how this all works. Uh, you'll learn a lot from bet, about the betting industry uh, along the way. And the second goal is to really get you, give you a bit of a head start. Uh, take advantage of first deposit bonuses. Follow the tips for a week and turn two hundred into four hundred. Uh, so those are really the two goals, the financial goal and an education goal. So quickly, and I'm going to move through this quick. We've only got 15 minutes. Uh, I'm going to go through a bunch of things. So I'm just going to move quickly. Excuse me if I'm uh, speaking too fast. You can always pause. You can always go into the actual videos themselves and, and look and listen into the, the specific detail um, of each item. So here's the here's a sort of summary of um, the entire program. So day one, we talked about sort of the opportunity why is it a, why is there an opportunity now and high, on a high level how the system works day two we talked about the, we, we talk about the bookies and um, how the landscape looks around here and how they work uh, day three we talk about um, the profiling of customers so when I was working at 365 I learned a bunch of things about how they profile new and existing customers and now I'm obviously on this side of the fence so I can help with uh, sort of gaming that system if you like. Day four, talk about stake sizing and other tipping services. That'll be really interesting. Uh, day five, some tools for betters. Um, some of you may have heard of them, others will not have. So that'll be, a, they're really good to be aware of. Day six, we look at the bonus bets and, and psychology of risk and return. Uh, and day seven, really, this is where we're at now and just going through everything um, proceeding today. So why is there an opportunity? So basically, long story short, the bookies use promotions to acquire and retain customers. The things that they're throwing out there in 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 huge volumes at the moment are these bonus bets back for second and third, just week in, week out. They've been doing this for four years um, now, and they're only ramping them. There's, there's just more and more of them. Um, the reasons they do this are because essentially bookie our betters just don't have the ability to outsmart them on them so uh, and when you dig deeper why can't they well there are two parts to it one is finding value and two is knowing what to do with a bonus bet and most people don't know how to take advantage of a bonus bet which is why there's an opportunity here uh, that's that's really the number one reason so um, it's an amazing time right now in australia given we've got so many bookies all fighting for you as a customer and they're just throwing around value. There are literally 10 bookies that you can have accounts with and you can extract at least a thousand or two out of them all, um, if not much, much more uh, following a system. So the way I look at promotions, there are scalable ones and then there are non unscalable ones. Um, the bonus bets back, they're really scalable um, and they're really in two forms, the racing and the same game multis and this is what they look like. The early payouts, on the other hand, so leading at half time and, and getting uh, paid out, they're not scalable, so I'd stay away from them. They're kind of traps. The bookies just end up promo banning you, so stick away from them. Uh, this is what I just mentioned there. So it's it's hard for most people to find value, and most people just can't convert bonus bets efficiently, which is why there's an opportunity. So quickly going to go through into the system. So we've got the racing model, the same game multi model, the bonus bet system, and, and really account sustainability here as well. So racing model, we're looking for we're looking for as close to fair value as we can. We can use uh, we can use Betfair, we can use bookie prices across the board. But essentially, where when there's a racing tip, there are two things happening. One is you're getting extremely close to fair value, uh, and two, um, you're there is there's more than thirty percent of expected edge in that bet. Um, and how do we do that? Well, without going into the details now, because I don't have time, um, we, we imply prices from Betfair and across other bookies, look at price movements, look at, uh, at, at volumes that are going through, and from that we're able to imply what a uh, fair price might be. That's really at the heart of the, the racing model. 
Um, and just quickly, one more thing on that on the racing model. Even without the bonus bet insurance, the tips win at approximately 2 to 3% on turnover. So we're finding good value even without the insurance. But then with the insurance of the bonus bets, you get, there's about 30% of edge. Here's a good example of how the bookies take the piss. Um, so Betfair here in this instance, and this is just before the jump as well, $3.10. You could, you could from this imply that the true price is $3.15 and tab here, two forty. Like they do this all day long and our, our model looks to snipe the value around it. How's it gone in the past? Well, the profit worm, it's absolutely killing it. Um, many members say uh, this is the best tipping service in Australia. Same game, multi-model, again, moving through very quickly. We're just trying to find fair value. It's hard to find uh, a multi that has anywhere near, cl cl anywhere near close to fair value on all legs, but we're able to find very, very close to fair value on each leg. And what that means, when you multiply them out, you've got some decent edge. This, this example had 25.8%. This model wins at um, very close to 30% as well. Funnily enough, it's close to the racing one. So that's, that's how that works. How's that gone? Um, also extremely strong. Um, you can see there's, there are little bumps along the way, but if you stake correctly, you just enjoy that uh, profit curve there. And then we've got the, um, I guess the, the final piece of the, the betting jigsaw is bonus bets. So you're gonna get a bunch of bonus bets back um, for coming second or third or for having a leg fail. We've got a system that converts bonus bets really efficiently uh, through two methods. One's through tipping value and two is um, through a bet fair lay method which you can learn a lot more about in the um, in the other videos. Cool, and then finally here, uh, account sustainability. This is, so this is ex extremely important. If all you do is bash promos, the bookies will promo ban you. So there's an account sustainability document that you wanna have a look at if you wanna take this system seriously. That's gonna really increase the lifetime value of your accounts. Uh, and that's, that's important if you see this is a long-term proposition. Some guys come in and they're happy to make sort of aiming to make five, 10 grand in three, four, five months and just get out, that's it. They just wanted to make that amount of money, um, that's fine. Others wanna see this as a longer term thing, six, 12, 18 months um, of just consistently milking the bookies. If that's you uh, in that second category, this is very important, so have a look at all that. And message me if you've got any problems. Uh, yep, these are all the um, sort of the, the high level results that we've gotten. The golf, just on the golf, um, I was ahead of in play golf for the Asian time zone when I was at Bet365, I learned a lot there. I, I know golf um, very well and a lot of the tips, the bonus bet tips come through on golf and uh, so I use kind of my insights on that. I've got my own golf model which simulates uh, course data, uh, using course data and player data. Uh, and historically the golf bonus bet tips are converting at 114%, which is obviously extremely good. So setting up new accounts. So you get these first deposit bonuses. Strongly recommend if you don't already have accounts with all the majors, major bookies, open them up as soon as you can. Uh, don't deposit. Often they'll in invite you to um, get a first deposit match offer, which is just free money. You just use the bonus bet conversion methods that we've got to convert that into real money. Um, any questions again, let me know. But this is kind of step one as, as you're on your journey. It's good to have access to all of them so you're not bashing one or two each week. You're sort of spreading your betting around. So the bookie landscape. So again, flying through these things. I look at them in three tiers, sort of T1, T2, T3. These are all really good ones. These guys are kind of, they've got some pretty good promos, but they, they promo ban fairly quickly. And here are some others, um, other relatively new ones, but there's some good value that you can extract out of those as well. So uh, this was actually an example earlier. So how do they, they make, um, how do they make money? I mean, essentially they just, they, they come up with their own theoretical value and then they just bet massive unders. Um, <laughs> this example is quite extreme, 240 when the true price is 315. Uh, so that's kind of one part of it. Then skewness, they'll often skew their prices away from flow or anticipated flow. Uh, and then the third thing here, it's just fixed versus tote racing. Uh, I'd, I'd stay away from tote racing. It's for the average punter, the odds are significantly against you. Fixed odds um, is a far fairer market. And you can, again, read the other. Look into the videos to f learn more about that. Um, all right, so moving through. Um, so yeah, now that you've opened your account, you should have offered, been offered these first some to first deposit bonuses. Again, you're just trying to look like you've lost interest and then the bookies will chase you to try and get you to deposit. That's kind of a key metric that they have. If they get you to deposit, the way they look at you is you're likely to just be a long-term customer. 
Uh, account sustainability, again, very important if you want to see this as a long-term proposition. There's a, there's a promo account sustainability document in the members resources section. Strongly recommend you check out that. Then day four, okay, stake sizing. So stake sizing, Kelly, um, how other tipping services work. So just firstly, just how the historical panel has gone. So you can see it's like a nice jiggity line up uh, to the top right there. So all these little bumps, like some of them can be like three day, three losing days in a row. Here's four losing days in a row. So there's a bit of variance, but all you need to do is manage stake sizing and you're sweet. Uh, that's really all you need to do. Um, there's a Monte Carlo simulator I've created that'll allow you to sort of dig deeper into the numbers. But long story short, if you're just betting five percent of your bankroll per race, you'll be you'll be fine. You'll be able to wear out those short-term runs of bad luck. Um, you just want to stick to the system with the bonus bet conversion. You don't want to do anything too fancy. All right, again, flying through. We've got four minutes to go. I promised I'd do this in fifteen minutes. Kelly, yeah, this is, um, if you give this a Google, the interwebs light up, but this is kind of the mathematics behind how stake sizing works. Um, but again, the 5% rule is all you really need to know um, to apply the system here. How the tipping services work, nearly all of them have are affiliates, which means they get a profit of your, uh, lot, a percentage of your losses that, from the bookmaker that they've referred you to. So, I mean, that's that's a ridiculous <laughs> conflict of interest, obviously. Or they get a uh, percentage of, or they get a sign-up bonus. So they refer you to Ladbrokes and they get 100 bucks from Ladbrokes. So it's a massive conflict. Nearly all of them don't um, don't say that they've got that conflict. They're not up front. Um, nearly all of them are don't, not very transparent. They don't have any edge. So there's a lot of shit out there just to stay away from. We're very, we're 100% uh, transparent about our numbers, that we've got no affiliate things. We, in fact, try and stay under the radar from the bookies. Three tools for intermediate and advanced bettors. Yeah, Betfair, Odds Checker, Ghost VPN. Check out this video if you want to learn more. But Betfair, if you're going to take betting half seriously, um, even half seriously, you want to know what Betfair is and kind of how to execute some basics on there. Very useful. Um, VPN software. So I'll go through that in a sec. We're about to get to it actually in a sec. So yeah, so here's um, some things that you can do with Betfair. You can, you can lay um bonus bets so you can turn them over that just basically locks in um bonus bet value uh members get access to this portfolio position uh calculator which helps you sort of work out exactly what your position is when you've had a bunch of bets on a uh, on the same event golf is a very exa good example of when that happens odds checkout really good odds comparison tool um, if you want to if you're going to take your betting seriously you need to be getting top or close to top odds it makes a huge difference Ghost VPN, this allows you to bet in play on Betfair from Australia um, just by clicking through. You don't have to call up. Super useful. Two minutes to go. So bonus bets, uh, the psychology of risk and return, how pros approach this. So bonus bets, there are two methods. One is just follow the bonus bet tips that we have. Two is lay on Betfair. So this method one, there's some variance here. You might have 10 losers in a row. Whereas if you're laying on Betfair, you're locking it in. Our bonus bets value calculator shows you how much um, you, you know to back and lay for for what payoff. So that's super useful. Psychology of risk and return. We've got a lot of biases in betting and finance. These like psychological biases. If you're interested, you know, look into this or watch the video. Uh, how pros approach betting? Well, they're just very systematic. They don't bring emotions into it. They can look at it on a profit per bet level in, in terms of expectancy or day or probabilities. Um, but essentially just applying a system methodically. So wrapping up common traps, I think, look, there's a lot of stuff here that you can go into in, in more detail and I'm happy to answer any questions on those, but essentially to apply this system, you just need to be disciplined with your stake sizing um, and follow some promo account sustainability rules, um, which I've, I've mentioned a few times. Uh, final thoughts. So look, I think there's an opportunity in the next 12 to 18 months to really smash the bookies on these promos. After that, what's going to happen? I think they're going to get why they're going to wise up to how systems like this are actually skimming them. As I mentioned, bonus bets. Uh, with bonus bets, most can't convert them efficiently into cash. The average better in Australia converts them at twenty five percent. Our system converts at like ninety to one hundred percent. So they're going to wise up to that. Um, and then they're going to drop the, the value in the promos. But for now, 
it's 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 a glory period. So then the, then the other, only other question is, you know, what, how do you want to apply this system? How is this relevant to you? Any questions, message me on these channels. Cheers.